That scary homeless lady made me miss my friends, though. I was all, like, stuck in my apartment. I was like, you remind me of my best friend. <laughs> I do. I miss my friends. I miss doing everything that's normal. Like, I miss going to brunch with my friends and throwing a mimosa in their face, you know? I do. I also miss them getting so drunk at brunch that I spill all my friends' mimosas. That's my favorite part about brunch, is knocking other people's <laughs> over. That's what I love. But, like, I just miss... I miss everything about life because it's one of the weirdest things. It's like, because I'm trying to f I don't know about the rest of you people, but like, I am a slut interrupted. Anyone? <laughs> Do you know how hard this is? I went to a psychic and the psychic told me, she goes, you know, your heart chakra isn't rotating. And I go, uh, duh. Hello. <laughs> I'm a gay man from Texas. We don't feel. <laughs> We are not allowed to feel. Like, the only way grown gay men from Texas are allowed to feel and express our emotions is just through, like, clever and inventive furniture arrangements. <laughs> Why do you think white ladies call us all the time? They need help arranging their emotions. It's true. And, like, I... The other problem is, like, trying to be a slut during a pandemic is, like, y'all, all of my daddies have cut me off. All of them. The Toluca Lake daddies, the Holmby Hills daddies, like, all of them. And I hate it. I get this call. They're like, we're in a vulnerable category. You know, like, we have high mortality rates. Like, put your penis away, guys. That is not sexy. You know? Nobody wants to f*** a dude with a mortality rate. It's so sad. Oh, sorry. I didn't get a honk for f***ing old men. You listen to me, Pasadena. You f***ing listen to me. No, no, no. No, no. It's too late now. If you think it's gross to f*** an old man, I'm here to tell you it's not. Okay? Old men are sexy. All right? Yeah, toot toot. I hear ya. AARP postmenopausal son of a bitch right over there. I hear ya, daddy. <laughs> the only gross thing about an old man is seeing like all of the knee braces scattered all over the bedroom floor. Like, that's gross. <laughs> like the pictures of his children all over the like bedroom wall. That's gross too. That is. Gross. Uh, but it's just hard for me, like, cause I'm, like, gay men are to blame for coronavirus. Like we're, f***ing, you know. Oh please, like you are f***ing out there too. You bunch of heterosexual sons of. <laughs> It's true, if AIDS couldn't stop gay men, a little pandemic is not gonna stand in the way, okay? Some <laughs> is worth getting Nana sick, all right? It's like, it's true, she's a MAGA voter anyway. I, I did, I had, okay, because here's the problem, okay? I had to break quarantine because the last time I had sex was before quarantine. I was touring the world with like my comedy hero and we were on tour when we got called home and the last place I had sex was in Oklahoma City, people. That's unacceptable. <laughs> That's not okay.